Good morning, Flint Hill. We're so happy to have you with us today. Today you'll be hearing from Team 3, which consists of Kiara Hustis Thompson, Miley Morrell, and Jarvis Williams. Boys and girls, have a great day and enjoy today's news show. Good morning, today is March 25th, 2022, and I'm here with your announcements. This is what is going around in Flint Hill today. Today will be Special Sortation E. Today is National Newberg Day. Make sure to check out our book on Canvas. Get excited, the book fair opens today online. Remember how, now for our weather. Good morning, I am Miley with today's weather. The high will be 61 degrees and a low of 41 degrees. Looks like it'll be a sunny day. Enjoy your day, now try lunch for me. Hello, I'm Jars with today's lunch menu. The cafeteria will be serving buffalo wings, barbecue oven roasted wings, whole grain roll, PB&J sandwich and cheese sticks, oven baked okra, celery and carrots, pineapple with cherry, and your choice of milk. And now to Mr. Guest for, with some suggestions from the book fair. Oh, sorry, I didn't see you there. I was too busy reading my book from the book fair. Hey, you know when the book fair is going to be? The book fair is this Friday, March 25th, until next Friday, April 1st. Every class gets two, count it, two, say it one more time, two assigned shopping days during school. And if your mom or dad, grandma, grandpa, dog, aunt, uncle, cat, a uh, long, 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 long lost grandfather wants to show up and come to the book fair, it's open on Tuesday, March 29th until 6 p.m. You can get books like The Imposter's Guide to Among Us, Dog Man Unleashed, and my personal favorite, Bob the Boogie Fairy with your personal own little booger. Have a great day. Attention, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, for liberty and justice for all. National Lobster New Work Day National Lobster New Work Day is a holiday that's observed on March 25th 
an anursa dish that was first prepared over 145 plus years ago. For those of you who aren't familiar with this dish, it's made from a combination of lobster, egg yolks, heavy cream, butter, dry medin or sherry, cayenne pepper and nutmeg. It's a luxurious, rich and delicious dish that most people are going to enjoy on this holiday. So get ready to celebrate this holiday by buying the ingredients that are needed to make it and then learning the recipe. This is a dish that people can make their own and still delight their friends and family members with it. According to the most popular legend about this dish, it was first invented when Ben Wenberg, a sea captain in the fruit trade, introduced this dish to Dan Monico's restaurant in New York City. It was supposedly a popular food among sailors. It's said that the chef of Dan Monico's at the time, Charles Renhofer, then made a few refinements to the recipe and added to the menu as lobster a la Wenberg in 1876. It became an immediate hit. The legend continues on to say that there was eventually a fallout between Wenberg and Almonico and that resulted in the dish being removed from the menu. However, patrons still wanted the dish, so the restaurants had to add it back to the menu. They just renamed it to Lobster Newberg, an anagram of Wenberg. Of course, as is usually the case with most legends, historians have debunked this legend. Culinary historians say that it was simple lobster added to French-inspired sauce that was already popular during 1870s, and that early mentions of this dish say nothing about it being invented by Wenberg or that it was even named Lobster Wenberg in the first place. To celebrate this holiday, gather up your cooking utensils, make sure that your pantry is stocked with lobster and sherry, and then take time to observe this holiday by making some lobster new work.